Hi, this is Crystal and Ben, and these are Rose's Five Babies, born on June 13th, which happens to be my birthday. And uh, it, it, we held this litter back a little bit because there was a lot of babies on at that point, at that time, and this litter needed just a little bit of adjustment period. But they're doing great now, and um, I'll start with this one that's got a blue dot on his butt. He's a traditional, really kind of just a chubby little boy. He's got a little ghost line on his forehead, no pinto spots. He's kind of that traditional hedgehog, I think, of when people say what they're looking for in a hedgehog. is just um, medium color mask, nice quills back, well adjusted. His brother, here has a red dot on his butt. He's a lot lighter than his, uh, than the last one that I just, sh I just sh um, sh showed. But um, he's got almost a white sheen to his quills. And so, and he's got a much lighter mask. Hey. Super friendly. I gotta get you to ball up. <clears throat> Hi. Hi there. We got a ticklish tummy. We got a little tickle tummy. <laughs> He's got a very sweet little personality. Definitely doesn't uh, go in the ball very well. No, he does not. Right? He's like, <laughs> He's... I don't need to ball up. That's an odd position for me. Maybe I'll go this way with you. I'll go check out the habitat. Uh -huh. Okay, so the next one that I have in my hand has an orange dot on his butt. He's got a much darker, uh, you can see much darker quills. He's got a little line of white quills that kind of run through him a little bit. A couple speckled white ones here and there throughout his backside. And if I, he's more vocal, like you hear him. So he's like, oh, hear me. Look at his beautiful <laughs> face. He's pretty. Hi. But I definitely feel like he makes more noises than his brothers do. Hi there. You want to go play? He's chuttery sounding. Still lets me paint, you know, touch his forehead. And he's putting his quills back. But he's, uh, you know, he's, he's communicating with me. Mm -hmm. Chubby. Little chubber. Okay, this one you did an America on it again. We did a blue and a red, red blue dot on him. Let's close your legs a little bit, dude. There you go. <laughs> He's got a little ghost stripe on his forehead. You're kicking yourself in your face. Really no pinto spots. See that chuttery one back there? He's like back there kind of squeaking he's, and making He's singing a little too. bit. Yeah, he is. He kinda, he's just a noisy hedgehog. He's talkative. Talkative, yeah. I'd say most hedgehogs, once they're past the nursing state, we really don't hear too much from them. They're a pretty quiet animal, except you know, they run on their wheel and stuff, but they don't really make a lot of noises. And on occasion here and there, you'll have um, one that is a chirper or makes a noise or like, and that's one of the ones in the back. So this guy has a green dot on his butt. <laughs> and uh, some ghost stripes on his forehead. 
he's on the go. I can pet him nicely. Hi. It's got more of a yellow belly. Yeah. Could just be from wet bedding or something yeah, too, I'm not sure. Be. Okay, so that is it with Rose's babies. If you are interested in these, they are ready to go. This litter doesn't necessarily need the insectivore food. I won't make it a requirement with this litter. The small litters definitely need that for healthy, but I've been feeding these guys bugs, heavy, heavy bugs this last month. So uh, I'd make it an option for you. I recommend it. You know, hedgehogs are insectivores. They're not really meant to eat a processed, crunchy cat food. So they live better and healthier lives when they have uh, rich, nutritious bugs added. And these are freeze dried. They don't have to go in your refrigerator. Um, the mixture that Ben makes has a huge variety of mealworms, soldier flies, soldier fly larvae, lots of crushed crickets. It's got lots of stuff in there. And um, you know, I'll help you out there, dude. Whoops. I didn't mean to scare you. Here, you can go down right here. There you go. Here, oh, all right. <laughs> Run down that way. But um, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Text me if you have any questions. Bye. Mm, bye.